Hey everyone, it's Crypto Profit back with another video, and today we're going to be taking a quick look at the market and talking about what coins you guys should be investing in before the potential bull market takes place. So we're down about 1.5 to 2% in this last 24-hour period. A lot of coins just coming down and kind of settling before the next bounce up. And I will say there's a huge potential based on Bitcoin reaching above 45 to 48K. There is resistance there that we need to surpass to see altcoins follow ahead. So I want to talk about what coins specifically that I am investing in and what coins you guys should be looking into during this 2% decrease. Well, Ethereum is only down 0.26%. Unfortunately, you're not going to get a huge discount on Ethereum, in my opinion, before we see this really push up to 5 to even 10K. Ethereum is one of those coins that has so much value, so many use cases, so much really utility and features that have already been built into this really blockchain altogether. I think Ethereum is going to be an obvious winner. It's going to continue to build up 5 to 10K, like I said, by the end of this next bull market at the very, very least. And we have a ton of big reasons as to why. So we can see the trading, acti uh, the trading activity actually here. I was pointing at the market cap for a second, but the trading activity right here is 65% buy, 35%. So obviously going to continue to raise that price up. And we also have the market cap at $375.4 billion. It's much lower than Bitcoin. So it gives you a bigger percent chance for a higher profits. So if we take a look at Bitcoin right now, the market cap is much, much higher. So Bitcoin right here, $842.2 billion, much, much higher, going to require a lot more funds to actually push Bitcoin to double its price point or triple its price point than Ethereum. And that's exactly why Ethereum is, in my opinion, the play versus Bitcoin at the moment for a lot of people, unless you, you know, you're trying to stack a lot of your money, you know, 80% of your wealth, then you're going to want to start putting some of your money into Bitcoin as well. But right now, if you're stacking, you know, 20 to 40% of your wealth, you're trying to just get some quick returns. You're looking for big money makers. Ethereum is definitely a potential big money maker as we definitely have potential for a two to three X in, like I said, this next bull run. I do want to jump back to the price points and talk about four other coins specifically. So Ethereum is kind of an obvious choice, in my opinion. Um, I'm going to go for four others that are really not as obvious. So if we jump down just a little bit, Solana is definitely one of the best blockchains out there. It competes with Ethereum in many, many ways. If we take a look at the last 24 hours, it's up 1.34%. However, we are going to come back down from this percent increase because the market's looking kind of stabilized right now. I do expect us to see about a $99, $98 price point, which is definitely a good buy-in option for a lot of us. The last week has been really, really solid for Solana. 8.5% of an increase the last month, about a 12% increase. The one thing to note, is that we had a huge all-time high push of $260 and we're at $100 now. There's definitely, without a doubt, in my opinion, going to be a new all-time high for Solana in this next bull run, anywhere between $300 to $500. And because of that, Solana is easily a very, very good option for a lot of us to be investing in right now. It's definitely one I'm continuing to dollar cost average in on as it has so much potential. I do want to say, guys, that's all about what we're trying to get today is we're trying to look for those with huge potential and huge possibilities for two, three, four, five, or even six X in just the next three to five years at the very least. So $33 billion market cap is actually not too bad. If you compare Solana to Ethereum, it's a much higher potential for higher returns, like 5 to 10x. Let's go back and take a look at the prices. Before we jump into the last three coins, which are going to be some pretty important ones, I want to tell you guys a little bit about BlockFi. So you could actually buy, sell, and earn cryptocurrency with the BlockFi Rewards credit card. It lets you earn up to 3.5% back in crypto on every single purchase. So if you guys haven't taken advantage of BlockFi yet, jump down into the description of today's video. Use my link. BlockFi is going to give you up to $250 worth of Bitcoin when you first sign up, which is absolutely huge. Definitely during a 1% to 2% decrease in the last 24 hours, it's actually going to give you a little bit more than it would have yesterday. So it's uh, definitely a good time to jump on board and over $15 million in crypto paid in rewards to date. And there are also no annual fees. That is absolutely amazing for such a big company to be doing this and giving us such a great opportunity. I want to jump, though, back over to some of these cryptocurrencies and talk about what I would be investing in, what I am currently looking into investing in with my dollar cost averaging uh, kind of strategy that I take advantage of. So Polkadot's been doing really, really well, almost too well. And I think there is going to be a time that we see Polkadot run up from 2087 that we are currently at 
all the way up to a potential $30 to $40 before the bull market even begins. With that, you're going to see a nice almost 2x. And then from there, we're going to see much, much more. So Polkadot's a very, very good example of what to look into right now. $20.6 billion in market cap. If we take a look at the last year, a 37% decrease. We had an all-time high of $55 right now at $20.87. This is a huge opportunity. The last week has been a 6.5% increase. We just saw a new parachain auction get involved with, um, you know, Polkadot. And I want to say, you know, as we continue to see Polkadot rise and in increase in value, you have to remember you're getting 12 to 14% APY with that going on as well. So huge money to be made, passive income, all of it with Polkadot right now. It's a definite yes for me on Polkadot as we jump into coin number four. So there's a lot of great coins that we've been talking about. And because I talked about Ethereum, I feel like I have to bring up Polygon. Polygon Matic is one that definitely helps Ethereum succeed. The last day, though, down about 1.7%. In the last week, up about 3.85%. So you're getting a small downturn in this last 24-hour period. Below $1.60, you're getting $1.59 as the current price point. The market cap at $12.3 billion. You're seeing the trading activity continuing to be 64% buy, which is really, really solid. Polygon has been one of those coins for a while that has had so much utility and use case when it comes to the Ethereum blockchain that we are going to continue to see it really thrive in my opinion, this next bull market as well. So Polygon was formerly called the Matic Network. Polygon Matic is an Ethereum token that powers the Polygon Network, a scaling solution for Ethereum. Polygon actually aims to provide faster and cheaper transactions on Ethereum using Layer 2 sidechains, which are blockchains that run alongside the Ethereum main chain. Users can actually deposit Ethereum tokens to a Polygon smart contract, interact with them within Polygon, and then later withdraw them back to the Ethereum main chain. So there's huge reasons as to why people aren't getting involved and invested with Polygon. If you guys want to, I guess, kind of learn a little bit more about Polygon and learn a little bit more about cryptocurrency in general, before we talk about coin number five, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on to stay up to date with all of it throughout the next couple of weeks, as these are, like I said, very, very important weeks to see where we're headed next with Bitcoin right at that 44K mark right now. I want to jump down, though, and talk about one of my favorite coins altogether. You guys should have known this one was coming. I don't mention it in every top five video just to kind of give you guys some uh, just some mix and variety. But Chainlink is such a very, very undervalued coin right now. It's hard not to talk about. In the last day, it's down about 2%, 1.64%. Um, the last month, though, we are have seen a small, slight increase of about 6 to 7%. The big thing to note, though, is Chainlink's at $15.63. If you look at the all-time high, it actually reached all the way up to $53. And it was a fast, fast push. From April 24th all the way up to May 9th, we saw a very, very fast increase for Chainlink. There's definitely a big possibility that we see Chainlink reach $100 to even $120 by the next bull market. That's going to be a huge increase, huge profit for a lot of us. And there's reasons I believe this. So if we jump down here, you can see the trading activity being 67% buy, only 33% sell. The typical hold time is much longer than many, many other cryptocurrencies at 85 days. We also see the market cap at a very low $7.3 billion. There's huge potential behind this. I don't see Chainlink going below $10 to $12 before we reach new all time. Really, it I guess it does depend on Bitcoin, but realistically, chain link below ten to twelve dollars, I don't see happening within the next you know bull market. So we're gonna see what happens here. I definitely think chain link is worth looking into if you have not already. It's one that I have continued to dollar cost average in on over the many years. So keep that in mind as well. Just want to give you guys full transparency. I've invested in every single one of these top five coins. I wouldn't be mentioning them as top five coins to get into if I didn't invest in them. It just doesn't make sense. So Thank you guys again for tuning in. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. I'll see you guys all in the next one.